For the first time, honorary consuls from around the world have gathered at a table in Tirana to share thoughts and experiences and also to choose their governing structures. Through discussion and sharing of opinion, the consultants have decided to choose an honorary dean to exercise their functions in Albania. With an open vote, the honorary consul of Austria in Tirana will be held by the dean's office. But the honorary consultants have also decided to give another dimension to their common task and create an association of honorary consuls in Tirana. The association will serve as an instrument for mediation, exchanging experiences, and initiatives in the economic and diplomatic fields. With an open vote, the honorary consul of Austria in Tirana elected Mr. Jerzy Legezia as the dean of this council. When there is interest upset for more in there, we have to, we have to mount, uh, the for me, it is a pretty big honor and responsibility. I will try to implement what I have learned from this work to give the best performance possible. But it is clear that we will always keep in touch with each other. I hope that this meeting will be a good start as it will exchange opinions and experiences that are well grounded, said Ligesia. Unanimously, the 17 councils present at the table elected the honorary consul of Mexico in Tirana, Mr. Ulian Drochi, as the chairman of the new association. The head of the association shall have a term of one year, with the right of re-election only for one additional term, and will protect the rights of the councils and represent them among the international organizations. The honorary consul of Mexico, Yuli Androchi, was committed to supporting his colleagues and promised to try to ensure maximum respect for the rights and privileges of other honorary consuls. <laughs> me voto që votuat këtu, por ju siguroj që nuk do t'i shgënjej, duke që ndruar gjithmon pran kërkesave t'ju ja. I am very excited for the confidence that you have in me, and I would like to assure you that you will not be disappointed in your requirements for the most important things that this council needs, for any event or activity that will be organized by the state protocol, but also for the problems arising from being consuls of other European countries. I assure you that from this moment, I will give you worthy representation for any kind of request that you have among the consuls in the foreign ministry. And this is not going to be done only by press coverage, but also by protecting our interests and listening to your suggestions and bringing them to the ministry in order to fulfill 100% of the aims that we may encounter during our path," said Mr. Ndrochi. This was only the beginning of a long journey for the honorary consuls in Tirana and meetings will continue every three months in fulfillment of their diplomatic mission. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Ditmir Bushati, gave a phone call to Mr. Ulian Drochi in order to congratulate him on his new position and wish him further success in his performance.